Um, I feel like, and again, I don't know these people, but right. on the outside looking in, it looks like the woman that the brat married um, is clearly a user. I think she used the brat in these three years. Manipulated. Uh, manipulated, pushed her for this, you know, all the TV show to push her career, to get her name out there more. You know, so I think she was a little established. But yeah, they she said she had the bag. When she, she had her own bag. Her own bag, yeah. She was a little established, but she wasn't as she wasn't where she is now being with the brat. Right. Do you think that's an abomination? Or did a lab baby egg swap, sperm put in, no no sex involved, period. All hospital, all technology. Do you think that's an abomination? All right, uh, after three short years or two short years of marriage and a, and a, uh, uh, a hospital baby, uh, uh, a surrogate baby, a uh, lab baby, lab baby, uh, the brat and her wife are divorcing. And of course on our channel, we we talk about marriage relationships, all that. Um, but we've never really spoken on same sex marriage. Uh, you know, divorce. Same sex divorce. We never talked about same sex divorce. That's because we don't believe in it. Well, That's a I, law that is, uh, if you're a true believer, then you know that we're supposed to be set apart from the world. That's a worldly law that allows same sex um, to each his own, but we don't really talk about it, I would think, because we don't really. They're getting divorced. It's, it's a it's a same sex divorce. Uh, the brat, and it's a baby involved. And I think the brat is asking for full custody of the baby, which she did carry the baby, but I don't think the egg was hers. And I know the seed, wasn't either of theirs because it's two ladies. So this is just the weirdest situation ever. And I and I hate to see the brat go through this at this age. It seemed like she would have been smarter than this. You told me that the woman had already had kids by men. I think they say she's cheating on the brat with a man. What's the deal? I, I've heard that she's cheating. I think they're assuming it's a man because apparently, um, but I, I heard that that's part of the reason why they're divorcing. Um, I feel like, and again, I don't know these people, but right. on the outside looking in, it looks like the woman that the brat married um, is clearly a user. I think she used the brat in these three years. Manipulated. Uh, manipulated, pushed her for this, you know, all the TV show to push her career, to get her name out there more. You know, so I think she was a little established. But yeah, they she said she had the bag. When she, she had her own bag. Her own bag, yeah. She was a little established, but she wasn't as, she wasn't where she is now being with the brat right. in such a uh, short time in three years. Now, as far as the child, I don't know who uh, provided the seed, but the brat did carry the child. And I think it's wrong for, I, I just hope brat, the brat gets custody because if I carry a child for nine months and push it, push it out and go through all that labor and heartache of, you know, the emotions, all that type of stuff that you have to go through with carrying a the child, then I want to be able to have full custody and raise my child. I don't think the brat would be mean to the other, what's her name, Judy or they, Jessica, they, whatever they, name they say uh, whatever the lady name is, they say that lady, uh, the brat's wife or, mm -hmm. you know, whoever, divorcee or whatever, they say she uh, she don't like nobody touching the baby. But uh, was it the brat's egg? They say it was the the, the woman she married egg that was I want, put I into want my, I just want my egg back then. It's a baby. Yeah, well, I'm, it's, a, it's a woman in divorce. I'm a man, I know See, women. all this stuff is so unnatural. You right. ain't supposed to be taking nobody in, putting it in nobody else, and then the baby come out, then you fighting over some weird stuff. Like, that's, it's, it's too much for me. It'd be too much. I ain't gonna lie, that's a lot. Hey, so, you know, not to say we're too bad, same subject, but it's, do you think that's an abomination? Or did a lab baby egg swap, sperm put in, no, no sex involved, period? All hospital, all technology. Do you think that's an abomination? I think it is um, unnatural. I'm going to say, just keep it with that word. Okay, okay. It's very unnatural. Okay. Yeah. Um, it, it's 
the reasons that came behind it to support same sex and all this type of stuff is just not a part of a world that I want to be part of. I pray I don't have to deal with it because again, it's just, it's too unnatural for me. <laughs> it's too, it, it's too borderline. Uh, some of it's just wrong and sinful. And then I don't, you know, because children are so innocent. So when you talk about, uh, I don't want to use the word abomination because at the end of the mm. day, you have these lab babies that's going to grow up and, you know, they're, they're people, they're a person. And, and I'm not being shady when I say lab baby. I don't know what else to call them when you take an egg and a sperm and you put it in somebody else and then somebody else gets give birth to it or you take this and then and I don't know I mean don't you have to do that in the lab for that to happen or something it's definitely not natural you don't do it. I can't give nobody my egg naturally this is all man made stuff you know them playing God or whatever that is mm. so you know to me I don't want no parts of it, it it's weird to me playing um, it's God very sounded different. bad well I mean and yeah, that's what it is yeah, it There is very bad. different it's very uh, unnatural and I don't want any parts of it but I don't want because these kids gonna have to grow up and, and, and they're little people and we want them to be the best and they are our future the kids are our future and we wanna just I show love to all of them but yeah that, that situation because now you in a situation Situation. Now I want my egg back, but I pushed the baby out, and this is the new divorce. And Lisa, Lisa <laughs> Ray is uh, the breast sister. And I think she uh, said that she wasn't for the marriage off the top. She made it very clear. She's always said that she wasn't for the marriage. She, you Did know, she attend the wedding, or was it a wedding? I can't. I think she. I think in the beginning when she found out. Uh, I think it was a big thing because they didn't talk for a while. And then when they did talk, I think they didn't talk because Lisa Way wasn't uh, cool with her sister being in a same sex relationship. Mm. And then I think when she found out her sister was getting married, she was upset because she felt like even though I didn't agree with this, I still support you and love you. I want to be there. So I don't, I think she was at the wedding, but I don't know because it was so much going around, but they did rekindle and was talking after she found out that she was getting married to the, to the lady, you know, so, because Lisa like, that's still my sister. I love her. And we love these people. We, you know, uh, we love and support Support our families regardless of what if we disagree on what you believe in I believe in but yeah I think Lisa but I do know Lisa is going to help and push for her to have that baby keep that baby this Brad, Brad is a first time mom I she can I mean to even see the look clips I don't really watch the show but the look clips that I've seen to see the Brad in such a motherly uh, uh or girly form you know with the tears and caring the child and and the natural part of you know being a woman was a beautiful thing to me to see her there because she's so uh the brat you know but I know black women and after and once we get a divorce, they want their egg back. <laughs> yeah, she They want their egg back. But I think I'm her motives and everything with it I think was yeah. was just not right from the get go. And I, agree I do with that. I, I'm I'm team DeBrat because I love um I'm 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 I love Lisa Ray. I'm a Lisa Ray fan. And that's her sister. And I and I'm also for uh the brat being a mother. And she's a first time mother. This is her first child. That other lady um got grown children, you know, already. So I I yeah, I just hope the brat get the baby. Would you relate with that relationship uh as like you uh normally say transactional relation? Is that one of the transactional relationships? I, I would say so. Yeah. It looked like straight business for for the young lady. For the, the brat woman. was in love. I think the brat really loved this woman, Hold or thought that. she did, what you know, that? or whatever the case is. Yeah. And it was transactional for the other lady. Yeah, that's what I would say. If I, uh, you know, on the outside, I'm gonna try to in. catapult off your little, you know, off you being the brat, whatever that's could count for in the two the 2020s. <laughs> All right. I mean, it's the brat. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah she's yeah. still straight. Yeah, Clearly. no, I didn't say she ain't straight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's straight. I'm sure she's straight. Yeah, yeah, she, yeah she's yeah. definitely in a higher bracket than that Dame Dash. <laughs> I'm sorry, uh, I shouldn't have done that shit. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, he out of here. Hundred, say a hundred thousand. His yeah. net worth. Uh, I, I, my cousins, my little cousins got a hundred thousand. <laughs> Man, part of your family <laughs> network surpassed yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah. uh I'm just curious of what the, the Brett network is. 
million. Oh, seven million. Is it seven million? Look, hey, if you guys haven't done already, uh, take time out, uh, like, subscribe, and uh, also watch this, um, the, the third marriage of this guy right here. Watch this. You're going to like it. <laughs> that's major. Yeah, that's 